What's up, Homestead fans, followers, friends, and fanatics? Which I guess is just like a fan. Um, coming to you from the depths of my basement, because uh, I basically live here now. I spent the weekend uh, replacing my water heater, which is a good time. Really good time. Um, I don't know if you know this, but if you were an English major in college, it really just sets you up really well for those kind of projects. So, um, not because it makes it uh, physically easier, but because I have a much better vocabulary than most people. So my cursing and screaming at least has some flair and, and style to it. Um, but I wanted to take this opportunity to kind of let you guys know about some things. Um, of course, you know, I'm always like trying to let you know what stuff we have coming up this week. And so in that spirit, let's see, I'm going to have Ten Penny that came out fresh at the end of last week. I got some Galactic Heroes, fantastic. Um, three MCs, good luck. Two people are going to get three MCs this week. None of it is available in bottles until uh, next week, so that's going to be... It's going to be rough. Pilsner, I just have six stills till next week. Good news, though, I have tons of fresh snake oil. Really, really great beer. If you haven't had snake oil, you got to try it. Uh, snake oil is going to be the next beer that we do in four packs. So keep your eyes open for that. Uh, we did the release for Matuika this past weekend. It was a huge, huge, huge success. Couldn't be happier, uh, not only with the effort that the Homestead crew made, but really happy with uh, um, the response in the market. It's a delicious beer, and we, uh, you know, th this whole four-pack thing is kind of new to us, so we're having fun with that. Um, I have one half barrel of Matueka left, which is freaking sweet. I was even selling it this weekend. I sold some on Friday night, uh, and then again on Saturday night. Excuse me, last night. I sold some last night. This week, this is really exciting. We have uh, Ulysses, which is our porter, really well-rounded, um, which was a strength and a weakness because as uh, Sam, our head brewer, pointed out to me, uh, balanced is not a flavor. Um, but when you make it Mocha Ulysses, now we're talking. So we're living La Vida Mocha. We've got uh, some lactose in there. It really helps beef up the body. Um, and that's pretty nice. Summer wheat. Summer wheat. I'm telling you, the warm weather's coming, but it's not going to come until we drink more summer wheat. So do your neighbors, your friends, and your family a favor. Order some summer wheat, and that's going to bring the, the good weather. I promise. Or at least, I promise to promise. Um, I also have some pastime lager left. Remember, those are value price. They're 55 bucks a sixtal, 130 bucks a half. This is an awesome amber lager. We looked at some really good selling uh, lagers and, and tried to match that price point. Um, so that's what I have for beers, but now I got to show you my home improvement tip. So over there, you can't see it, is my water heater, and it's in and it's functional and uh, I was able to actually shower yesterday afternoon, which is really nice because I went two days without. Um, i got a load of dishes upstairs that's really calling my name. But this right here, and hopefully you can see that, this is a really often neglected element to home ownership or even renting. You know, you got to make sure you're on top of these things. Um, but this is where your furnace air filter goes. And a good thing, if you're going to be in your basement trapped for the weekend doing projects is you can take this panel here and hopefully hopefully we can see this but if you just simply unscrew the panel just pop that off just like that filters right in here and it comes out nice and easy but what you can also do is hide beer in here and I chose to hide Galactic Heroes um, which is our West Coast IPA. Seven different hops, absolutely delicious. Um, but yeah, even though your, your family and your kids might think you're down here having an awful time, joke's on them. You've got beer to drink. 
So just remember, anytime you're tackling something easy or hard or frustrating or uh, exalting, just go ahead and mix it with your good friend, Galactic Heroes, and enjoy. All right, guys, thanks for your time. I know this one was kind of long, but I had a long weekend, and I feel like taking it out on you. Bye.